hey, how's it going? Hey, Buffman, what you got there in your hands? Oh, this? This is some of that uh, new Armorware AR680 level 3 plus plates. This is a 6x8 side plate. I heard that stuff just cracks when you look at it funny. Well, we won't know until we find out. Let's get set up. So for today's test, we have our Armorware level 3 plus side plate, 6x8. We were hoping to get some full size plates so we can get more shots per plate. But these little 6x8 plates will give us a good 6 shots to test on. We have our 22 inch standard M1A. We're going to be at about 30 to 35 yards. We're going to start with two rounds of M80 ball. And then if those don't go through, we've got some Israeli M61 armor piercing. I checked the core hardness on these guys and they come right around 47 on the C scale on the Rockwell. If these don't go through, I have those Lake City surplus ones that are a little faster than these on the chronograph. So up first we have two rounds of M80 ball. This is the Hurtenberger late 70s surplus. Hopefully the chronograph works. The sun's in and out today. I did get these to chronograph before the video at about 2,700 feet per second. We'll take two shots and then check our armor. So here are our two shots. As always, they're almost right on top of each other. There's a shot. There's little dimples there. We lost the coating already. There's a little bit of a dimple back there, but no pass through. That's pretty good. Their V50 rating on their website is 3175 for M193. They don't list a V50 rating at all for the 762. So it's good to know that we stopped it. Let's try the armor piercing stuff. So now we have two rounds of the Israeli M61 AP. We'll try to get a velocity off this. If not, I previously recorded right around 27 and a half. plate fell down. Let's go take a look. My chair fell down too. So here are our two shots. We've got two holes there. To be fair, a little too close to my previous two shots. I don't know why I keep shooting over there. So I'll flip the plate over and see if we can hit down there and see what it's going to do. So we'll take one more shot with the Israeli AP. Let's go see what we did. So here was our third shot. We have a pass through once again. Obviously I'm above and beyond what this plate is rated for. It stopped M80 ball at roughly 2700 feet per second. Two shots right on top of each other, no problem. But that M61 is just a little too tough for even this level 3 plus plate. Stay tuned for next time. I've got some more oddball threats to throw at these plates. Thanks for watching everybody.